So in this video, I'm going to be showcasing some of the new tools I got over the course of the past few weeks. So we got the T-blade bevel trimmers, the wall cordless magic clips, and the Bronze Series 9 shavers. Start this haircut by taking the hair down with a number 2 guard, wave cutting it, which means cutting it in the direction that the hair is growing. So I titled this video $2,000 clipper set versus $200 clipper set and it's because bro I'm coming to a crazy realization that my clipper collection is getting pretty expensive and it's not like I just collect I actually use so all these tools are growing in price really fast I want to put an emphasis on the fact that you don't need a $2,000 clipper set to start barbering or to be a good barber at all I just was able to get my hands on certain things unknowing that they were that expensive like the bevel trimmers we knew were two bills and i had no idea they were going to come out with 200 dollars andis these bronze i've always had my eye on them but these go for like 300 so you just put those three up together that's 700 dollars for three tools 700 dollars for three tools now when we're making like more expensive purchases for our clippers now we got to look at the actual value that it brings to what we're doing like, not just for the hype. What I'm getting out of my tool set now is a lot more speci specialization. Like, I have the luxury of customizing tools to cater to specific needs, specific types of haircuts, specific types of hair and people and skin. So that's the benefit of having a clipper set that is this versatile but it comes at its cost, right? To put it into better perspective for you, I remember when I first started cutting, I'd have one outliner, one trimmer, and when something got hot, I had no options. You know, I had to use it because it was the only tool I had to use. So now with a little more money to spend, I'm able to create this celebrity lineup of tools that I don't have to worry about heat, I don't have to worry about skin irritation, and I don't have to worry about them, for the most part, cutting well. Another obvious benefit to my current tool collection is everything's wireless. So I got 100% freedom and no wires dangling in my clients' faces or restricting my movement in terms of uh, like my blow dryer, for example, tangles up and it pulls itself out of the socket. Like I don't have to deal with that anymore. I'm just able to be free, move around. Look at this video, like I'm just doing as I please, you know, and it feels great. In this video, you see I have everything I need to kind of complete this cut. In the second part of this video, I'm gonna do a haircut with a $20 clipper set with no clips a comb um, yeah you'll see you'll see in a second and you'll see and I'll explain the difference and how I feel working with those tools $20 versus a $2,000 clipper collection check out these bevels they're actually cutting really well the first time I got them they didn't do very well now I've been working with them a little more, even with their new version 2 blade. And uh, they've been doing amazing. Like, been my go-to trimmers as of late. My current tool set, I just feel so much more free and efficient. I don't need everything I have, but I'm proud to have everything that I have. And it works well for me. There's too much stuff in my barber station right now. Like this stuff isn't lining up cleanly, you know? And I like to put them vertically, not horizontally. So I'm gonna need to cut one or two of these machines. One or two of these machines has to go because I need to be able to line them up like this so I could grab and go. So that's gonna take a little time to figure out, but what would you guys cut right now? If you guys could cut anything, what would you cut out of this six-man roster. 
So I showed you guys my $2,000 Clipper set. Now we got Walmart's. Remy, this can't be, what is this, 50 bucks? This can't be. Yeah, it can't be more than 50 bucks. We're gonna make it work on this guy and give him a favor. The scum way. I mean, you get it done regardless. Oh no, these are just stones. He's taking me from that to something else. I don't even know. To be honest, I'm on some Hollywood tip right now. Different time. I told him to do whatever you want to do. He got sauce. He got sauce. <laughs> I'm so <laughs> shook right now, bruh. <laughs> nah, but I, I trust you because you got sweat. So, and I trust my the process. I'm ready to try different things, you know? Last things. Um, yeah, I'm tired of getting the same dark Caesar. So let me give you guys some background on this whole situation. I came here to meet with a company called Hue. Uh, we did a photo shoot. We did a little video shoot. Uh, we went over some of their products. And I ended up meeting my dude here, Scum Lord. Uh, he needed a cut. He came to the studio to get a cut. The barber didn't show up, so I figured why not film this $20 clipper challenge video. Now, earlier in the video you saw that he mentioned $50 worth. I changed it to $20 because those Remingtons that I was using suck. They don't do anything. So I put those away. Like they're not doing anything right now. I'm trying to get a line, anything out of them. I'm about to retire them. I'm gonna do the whole haircut with those Walmart clippers on the table right there. I honestly understand now that is it is a luxury to work with what I have in my tool set. Working with these was very annoying and I, I don't feel like I got what I wanted out of them. So these clippers, there's nothing wrong with them actually. Like, these work just as good as magic clips. If I was able to zero gap them, I didn't have time to do that. But I wish we would have had a razor blade or some form of an outliner so that I would be able to make this cut sharp because I know I can. And quite frankly, I'm able to do the whole haircut with this. We didn't even have any clips. So I was doing a lot of clipper over comb. I have that number one clip. That was actually the only clip we had. Straight up guys, barber life is a grind. So it doesn't really matter what I use. I'm gonna get the job done. I've been hustling at this for a little while now and this doesn't phase me, but I understand the luxury I do have now. Like I literally couldn't get any hair off around the outline. And this brought me back to the days when I used to cut my brothers in my grandma's basement, like. The video that I shot in Atlantic Records, I have it on my page, where I'm standing on their table, I, I basically um, reenacted what I mean and really, how it really went down. And yeah. just... You already, bro? We here. Shout out to Hoop Dream, shout out to you, for every man. Shout out to my guy, Sage, for Fushi. There you guys go. The $20 Walmart Clippers versus the $200, the $2,000 Clipper set, really. Which way would you guys go? Damps. Damps.